and treated myself. And well, once I get it out of the box, I'll explain my rationale. So Omega Supreme is, has always been my, my favorite transformer. Um, but the, um, the Titans class Omega Supreme, I, I gotta be honest, I, I, I didn't like the, the overall look and design of it. Um, so I passed on him. I have the fans toys version of him, which in my opinion is as good as he's ever going to get, um, as far as a masterpiece style figure and the Titan class Omega Supreme put out by Hasbro. To me, it, it boils down to me not liking how narrow his shoulders were. I just feel like he was out of proportion and kind of goofy looking. But if they were to release him in a different color scheme, I'd be all in. So this is the um, the base Guardian robot uh, color scheme, which was honestly the only rationale for me buying this is that I, I got to have one of the Guardian robots in the uh, standard blue and white. So here he is out of the box. He comes with this cute little guy. Lunar Tread. For some reason, this color scheme makes it a lot easier for me to overlook the issues I have with his proportions. And let's look at him in base mode which is a big, big upgrade. There's Lunar Tread, and I love that the tracks are elevated. He is still a parts former, but the transformation is kind of clever and does not bother me nearly as much as the, uh, the vintage G1 transformation. And the little guy is meant to dock inside the tank. You also get some of these guys for uh, fake uh, laser blasts or the rocket blasting off. And even though my reasoning for buying this guy is thin, super happy with him.